All right, we're here with Logan Hitzman. Uh, Logan, just kind of overall thoughts on the match tonight. Um, it was good at times, but like just being good at times isn't good enough. Um, we got to stay sharp through 90 minutes, and we weren't able to do that tonight. Uh, from your perspective, what happened on those two uh, Georgia State goals that just kind of happened back to back there? Um, the first one, to be honest, I don't really remember it much. It kind of just happened. The second one, we just caught, got caught flat-footed. Uh, we didn't step to the ball. They just dribbled right at us, and they capitalized on our mistake. Uh, obviously, when facing Georgia State, one of the challenges is going up against one of the tougher keepers in the country. Uh, what challenges did you guys face going up against him tonight? Um, well, to start off, we didn't really take many shots on target, so we didn't really give him a challenge. So, like, our ch we didn't really have a challenge, if that makes sense. <laughs> yeah, gotcha. Um, Kyle's goal there. After all he's been through and how hard he works and, and how well he represents you guys, how rewarding was that for you as a teammate to see him uh, to get that goal? Uh, it was awesome to see his reaction. He kind of just looked at me after and just shock. He, I don't think he believed it went in without anybody touching it. Um, so I think it was, it was good for him, maybe give him a little bit of confidence going into the next game. Um, we need him at his best for us to succeed this year. And last question out of me, obviously Clemson in town next week. Uh, what do you guys need to work on, fix up, uh, to get ready for Clemson? We just need to be sharper overall and keep possession of the ball. And when they make mistakes, we have to capitalize on them like Georgia Southern did on us, or Georgia State did on us tonight. Um, we're, we're just not getting enough in the attack right now. All righty, Logan, thank you for your time, buddy.